What's going on YouTube here, Ryan 20 here back to another video in today. I found some I say today. I filmed this video today. I meant to film it a while ago, but I had some storage space issues. Um Yeah, so today I found some Hot Wheels, um, which I used to have as a little kid. And uh, some of them are really old, the model types. One dates back all the way to 1994, which I think was a legendary find. Because I used to love Hot Wheels. I used to play with them all the time. I used to have this huge Tupperware full of them, like all sorts of different shapes, sizes, looks, styles. So I'm going to showcase the ones that I found in storage. And uh, I didn't clear my desk off like I normally do for a review. I just left it decorated like I normally have it in my room. So, yeah, let's get into it so here are all the car models and um yeah i got a ton of them out of storage so yeah you know, let's start off with this one i guess i'll do one quick one or two quick spin arounds i gotta do my video because tomorrow's monday i gotta do my video in the fort that i promised you guys but it's terribly windy and terribly cold so i'm gonna have to get some uh pants on but a uh, pretty nice car here. I like the gold. It's a nice car. Got this red one here that looks like a real life racing car. Which I'll leave a comment down below if you know what kind of model racing car this is. Or if it's even a racing model in real life. So, pretty nice one. Have to space out things a little bit here. This one's the one that dates back to 1994. Proof uh, metal ink. 1994. So this one's pretty cool. A lot of it's diecast. I think the headlights are diecast. You got a pterodactyl or a pteranodon on the side. So pretty cool. I'll probably go for some money one day. And I got this red one. This one's my favorite right now. Looks very stealthy, very cool, very sharp. I don't think this one's that old though. So that's a pretty cool one. I like it. I like it. I like it a lot. And then the one that I'm gonna look at next is trying to drive away. My hand's getting tired from holding the camera. This is all handheld. So, you got this pickup truck, which is pretty nice. Pretty cool pickup truck. Paint scheme's a little bit weird, I will say. Then we got a blue one. This blue car, I don't think it's that old. I don't think it has a number on it. I don't see one. This is a newer looking model. So, pretty cool looking race car. Next one up is this one, which I only since die cast right here in the back. So, it's kind of weird. Hands tired. But, um, like the whole engine block on top is not, it's just plastic. Most of it's plastic. I don't think it's that old. 2004? What were you doing back in 2004? I'm trying to cheap out on the die cast. Hit against the one that wants to roll off my table 24. Don't you do it. Don't you do it. Anyway, we got this one right here. Oh, look at that chromey. This is called Twin Meal, I believe. On the bottom it says. But, very nice. This one doesn't roll as much because it's got rust on the wheel axes. So, that one's pretty cool. I like it. It's okay. Not my favorite. It was the first one I found, though, in storage. So, I was like, oh my god, this is one of my Hot Wheels. What else is in here? So, then we got this Formula One looking race car one. Uh, this is pretty cool. It's got number three written on the front of it. So, I guess it's pretty cool. Um, I like the idea of the Formula One race car. And then we got this one right here. It's black and white. And like I said, I didn't take any of the stuff off my desk. I got Funko Pops and stuff on my desk just to decorate it. 
so also I have a display shelf next to my uh, review table and sometimes I put whenever I'm reviewing a figure I put uh, accessories on there so I don't forget about them but uh, I'm going to show a picture of what it's displayed as now what it's what it's got displayed on it but we got blue one up next this one's the most interesting to me because it's just like blue it's um very ghost like it's got trans it's like uh like you can see to the inside of the vehicle so it's very ghostly very ghost like we got a red one up next this one's cool i like it i like the paint scheme number five on the side <clears throat> very cool whoops very cool more race car yellow cockpit although it is a car and not a jet so next up we got a color changing one this one's yellow and red but it switches from yellow to red since it's color changer which i think is pretty cool it's a little rat like creature next up we got is this yellow one or not yellow one purple one Next one we got up is yellow, and it's older. I think it goes back to 1998, but this one is 2001. So, 2001. And then the second oldest of the group is this one, which is 1990, what, 1990, yep, 1998 right there, Metal Ink, so... This is a pretty cool car. And, uh, yeah, it's okay. It kind of reminds me of a modern Camaro. Then we got a monster truck that says Maximum Destruction. And Maximum Destruction. I used to think that was Batman right there. I don't know why I just did. It looks like Batman to me. So, pretty cool. These were all the Hot Wheels I found in storage. So, I'll do one last overview of them all. So here we go, yellow ones, red ones, oranges, gold, and then monster truck. So that's all for that. Yeah, and they are what they are. And uh, it is what it is. I mean, you, you, I got all these different Hot Wheel models, and they, most of them are pretty cool. I wish I had a track and I can run them down on, or I could probably make one. Who knows? I'll maybe make. I'll start making future Hot Wheel videos. Um, that'll be great. I've got another couple hundred videos to kick out. <laughs> Oh, maybe that's how I should do 2019. I need to figure out a way I should do a video to celebrate 2019. So, um, it is, we are in the middle of October. October, we are in, I shouldn't say the middle, we are in October. I don't know what day of the week it is. It, it, it's Sunday, if that helps. My hair is still red. Uh, dyed it. Uh, link in the description below to my original I Dyed My Hair Red video, but that's all from me. I hope you all enjoyed this video. If so, be sure to click like, comment, and subscribe, and hit the notification bell so you never miss a video from my channel. That's all from me. Here we're in 2.0. Out.